storm clouds gather in her eyes Her daddy was a mean old mister Mama was an angel in the ground The weatherman called for a twister She prayed blow it down There's not enough rain in Oklahoma To wash the sins out of that house There's not enough wind Oklahoma to rip the nails out of the past. Shatter every window till it's all blown away. Every brick, every board, every slam and door blown away. Till there's nothing left standing, nothing left to yesterday. the sins out of that house. There's not enough wind in Oklahoma to rip the nails out of the past. Glamorous loose lounge we've got. Yes. What about the curlers, though, Katie? I know. I'm always late. <laughs> <laughs> well, try and get them out before you come on later, OK? If you have... No, no pun intended. Oh, oh, no, not like that. <laughs> <laughs> no, anyway, if you have a question for Katie or Carrie, or you just want to share your thoughts on what we're discussing today, then get in touch by going to our website, emailing us at loose.women at itv. Please welcome Carrie Underwood. <laughs> Well, that was before he cheats, one yes. of your massive, massive hits. Can you believe the success you've had in the last seven years? Um, a, a lot has happened in, yeah. in a relatively short amount of time, you know, for, for being in the music industry. Um, but I'm, I'm very thankful and glad I'm finally here. Yeah. Mm. Uh, I read that you were first offered a recording contract when you were 14 and then you went to university but what, and, and got a degree. What made you enter American Idol? Um, uh, well, I was... I didn't know what I was going to do when I graduated. Yeah. Um, as many people, you know, yeah. they start questioning and, and thinking, oh my gosh, I'm about to graduate college. Where do I go? What do I do? Um, so why not <laughs> try out for American Idol? Uh, I just thought, you know, I always loved to sing. Yeah. And um, I just saw them talking about it on TV. So I thought I... Did I'd... you always want to sing? Did you... What were you doing at university? Um, I always loved to sing. I always thought I was okay at it, you know? And, um, and people... <laughs> other people okay. sing. Well, I mean, there's so many amazing people out there who never get, who never get a chance. And what would make me 
special. Um, so I, I was always a very practical person and education is really important in my family and you know I, I still think sometimes my parents wonder when I'm gonna get get a real job. <laughs> um, so I, I, I don't know I'm, I'm so glad I yeah. ended up getting my degree and you know there's there's Sweet. something I'm qualified to do other than is it in journalism? Yes, it is. Right. Oh, yeah. you've got competition now. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Obviously, you're a country singer. Mm -hmm. Are you going to bring that over to the UK now? Because it's so popular in America. But it's, it's not actually quite as popular over here. So are you going to bring a whole new genre of music to the United Kingdom? Now? I think that would be wonderful because I, I really do. I mean, it doesn't just rest on my shoulders. I think there are so many of us that, you know, um, have been have been visiting more and, and bringing more of our music here. And that's really exciting because I, I do love country music. And, and right now is an exciting time because there's so many different kinds of country music artists. There are people that are, you know, more traditional. There are people that are more progressive. There are people that are more rock influenced. And uh, I really think there's something for everybody. There's artists that people can get behind and, yeah. and really enjoy. Because we've all done a bit of line dancing, haven't we, Jane? Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> a bit of line on the dancing. ground. <laughs> <laughs> but this is the album that's, uh, that came out on Monday, yes. and it's called Blown Away. And there's also a single, which you're going to sing for us later, that's also right. called Blown Away. Yeah, that's a bit later on in the program. So just tell us a little bit about this album, Karen. Um, well, I'm, I'm very proud of it. You know, I, I've been, I feel like over the past seven years, um, I feel like I've gotten a lot better, you know, vocally and as a, as a writer and as an artist um, in general. And uh, Have you written some of the songs on that? Yeah, yes. And I, I love to write, but it's not the end-all, be-all. Um, I, I want the best album possible. So yeah. if, I, if I write and great things come out of it, then that's amazing. But what if not, of, then that's, that's okay. What sort of stuff do you write about? What, what's in those songs? Are there messages in there? Or? Uh, a little bit of everything. There's definitely more personal, real life, you know, stories. Um, and then there's just some that are just fun. You, you create characters, you know, they're like mini movies in, in music <laughs> form and you just make, make stuff up. Well, I wanted to ask you one thing. Earlier we were talking about images of women mm -hmm. in the media and I know that your faith and your Christianity is very, very important to you. Does that affect how you dress? Because you're wearing a beautiful dress today but you are covered up. Um, I mean, you know, the, the most important thing for me to realize is I do things for myself, you know, and um, whether I'm completely covered up or whether I'm, you yeah, know. Like on the cover. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> whether I, whether I have something a bit shorter, because I do love shorts and, women and skirts. To look a certain way. I think there's definitely pressure on, on women and men, but I also think, you know, it's my parents would change the channel if there was something on there that they didn't want me to see. It was more about that and, and the women that I looked up to were in my family, you know, mm -hmm. mainly. Yeah. Um, and I, I think it's, you know, it's not necessarily the, the evil media's fault that, that we're getting like this. I think there needs to be a little more responsibility in the home. Mm -hmm. If you don't like the magazine. <laughs> Now, you're going on tour. Yes. Starting tomorrow night. Yes. What's taken you so long, madam? I don't know. <laughs> um, I, I think it was just all about, you know, country music, as we were discussing. Is yeah. it necessarily as popular here? Um, but, you know, I, I think this album was just a really, really good one to, to take outside of the U.S. And I feel like I'm, I'm established there and I'm comfortable there. And it's just time to... So we're going to be seeing quite a myself. bit of you in the U.K. And in I the think UK that would be wonderful. Yeah. yeah. And this, this visit, you know, hopefully is, is the beginning of more. It's fantastic. Yeah, it? we love it. We're so yeah. excited. We're so excited. Thank yeah. you very much. <laughs> and you're going to sing the single Blown Away later on at the end of the programme. Right. Yeah, thank you. For now, the wonderful Carrie Underwood.